To be honest, today I expected to make a video about how big of a scam Yeezy products have been. But then I got this in the mail. Recently, if you didn't know, Yeezy has been offering $20 on every single one of the shirts. Anything Yeezy branded, it is $20. They have shoes. They're, I don't know what these are necessarily. They're like, uh, like pods, I think is what they're called. They have wet t-shirts. They have a lot of different stuff. And me and Kayla ordered these things back in February before the Super Bowl. Since that point, we have gotten married and we have a child on the way, bro. We have so much giant life stuff that has happened since these Yeezy things came out. And now I just want to get an honest review on how good they are and see if they suck or not for $20. $20 is a steal. And long shipping times is something that I guess we just have to deal with from Yeezy in the future. With that being said, we're going to give you a little bit of an unboxing. Kayla already unboxed it a little bit. Um, but basically, <laughs> the first thing we have is this shirt and um it's not a very huge shirt like it's like well it is a huge shirt it's a very large shirt but uh the whole point is it just set, has a number three and you throw it on and then a number one in the back it's just easy it's just easy this is fashion you know a friend once told me recently actually if you don't look gay or homeless is it really fashion and honestly i think this one really just uh uh, accentuates both of those things. I feel like I'm looking hella gay and hella homeless right now. And uh, with that being said, I think we need to try Kayla's first. Uh, oh, did you not get a shirt? No. Oh, Kayla didn't get a shirt. My fault. Only I got a shirt. And then now we have these uh, Yeezy Pods. These Yeezy Pods are supposed to be the most comfortable shoes ever. I've seen multiple podcasts of him on where they're like, these are so comfortable. These are the best purchase I've ever made in my whole dang life. And it's one size fits all, I'm pretty sure. It is one size fits all. So let's see if one size can fit my um, feet. Okay, it comes in a little... A little bag. Cheap bag. It's a very cheap bag, I won't lie. But that's okay. Sorry. This is what they look like on the bottom. The soles are just two little patches of rubber. Ugh. They don't seem to be anything special. They smell like plastic. Hardcore. Let me turn this. They smell more like plastic than your mom after she left that random hospital visit. Oh my gosh. First off, thigh highs for the win, I guess. Um, second off, kind of just feels like I'm wearing a shin guard. If you ever played soccer, you under... Yes, soccer. If you ever played soccer, um, you will know that you have these tall, like socks basically that you have to shove the sin guard into that's what it kind of feels like currently don't know if this is how it's supposed to be worn hot this high but i'm every all the source material does show that it's worn this high <laughs> feel like a thigh high master right now kayla's pulled up uh, hers a little bit less i won't lie feels like i'm wearing a sock except i could also walk outside in it have you ever played volleyball and had sand, had socks. sand socks? That's what these feel like. Yeah, like a combination of shin guards and sand socks. Yeah. I don't know if that's a positive or a negative. I mean, if I, I could definitely see after a while. I'd feel like I'm not wearing these. Silly. Great alternative to socks, wow. low-key. I don't think that, like, like I mean, a perfect alternative to socks, honestly. Because I, I don't like when I'm walking around the house and I know that I'm wearing socks. And then I know that if I go outside, I'm going to rip up my socks. You know, let's say I got to go check on something in my car, forgot something in my car, did something like that. If I was wearing these, I could just run out to my car, grab it, pick it back up. They're almost like slippers. Yeah, but they take a second to put on. And also, I want to do a walk. No, but I would them. keep them. I would keep Ooh, them around. Squish your toes. It feels weird. It does feel weird to squish your toes. This pad definitely moves around a little bit. I would have wished that it kind of connected in the middle. You know what else this kind of feels like? If anybody ever danced in chat, well, I'm, I'm recording a video. Why did I just say chat? But if anybody ever danced, uh, you'll know. They feel like kind of like jazz shoes, except with bigger pads. So jazz shoes have these pads that you can spin on. And that's kind of what it feels like Made to a certain degree. Made in Italy. So uh, actually my entire opinion on this has changed. I actually would rate this a 10 out of 10. Italy forever. Um, 10 out of 10. Would definitely recommend the pods. Honestly, I feel gay and homeless in this. So I would also recommend this shirt. Happy pride. It is June. 
<laughs> Anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Yeezy is apparently not a scam. They will send you your stuff. You just got to wait a long time. See you beat ups later. Order my merch, by the way, and come to my Twitch streams. Yeah. Bye.